so today in this video we shall find hcf and lcm of x square plus 5x plus 6 and x square plus 4x plus 3 so we have first expression is equal to we have here x square plus 5x plus 6 so now first expression x square and last expression plus 6 is same so when we find lcm of 6 then we get 2 times 3 mean 6 and 2 plus 3 mean 5 so this 5x is equal to plus 2x plus 3x it is equal to 5x so now we find out common in these both first expression and these both last expression so common here is x remaining x plus 2 common in these both is plus 3 so remaining in first is x plus 3 times 2 means 6 so 2 so now again we find out common in these both expression so both contain x plus 2 so x plus 2 is common and the remaining in the first is x in the second is plus 3 like as second expression is equal to here we have x square plus 4x plus 3 so first expression x square and the last expression plus 3 both are same so when we take lcm of 3 then 3 times 1 mean 3 and we have here 4 so 3 plus 1 mean 4 so it is equal to plus 3x plus x plus 3x plus x means 4x so now we find out common in these both first expression and these both last expression so in the first common is x so remaining in the first x plus 3 like as common in these both is nothing nothing then common is 1 so remaining here x plus 3 so now the common in these both expression is x plus 3 so x plus 3 is common and the remaining in the first is x in the second is plus 1 so now we shall find out its hcf and it is equal to so hcf means common factors so common in first and second is both contain x plus 3 so its hcf is equal to x plus 3 like as its lcm is equal to first common factors and common here is x plus 3 so x plus 3 is common remaining in the first is x plus 2 so x plus 2 in the second expression remaining is x plus 1 so x plus 1 so its hcf is x plus 3 which is common in both and lcm is x plus 3 x plus 2 and x plus 1 so this much for today and thanks for watching